welcome to Environment News. I'm Nina Packard, and today we'll be discussing garbage. There are many interesting facts about garbage. For example, did you know that every year the U.S. creates 230 million tons of garbage that is sent to a landfill? So if you divide 230 million tons by 365 days of the year, you will find that on one day the U.S. creates 630,000 tons of garbage. And every day, each American creates 4.6 pounds of garbage. Also, even though Americans only make up 5% of the world's population, they create 40% of the world's garbage. And finally, 70% of garbage at landfills could have been reused or recycled. Along with many others, I think this information is very shocking. And now for some interviews. Today, our reporter Katie Lawrenson went out and found a couple of civilians and asked them how they feel about all of our garbage. Today, our first interview is with Dr. Richardson, a professor at the College of Environmental Studies. Dr. Richardson, how do you feel about all this garbage? Well, our Earth is becoming a total wasteland disaster. Do you have any suggestions on how we can reduce the amount of garbage we create? For starters, you can set a goal each week to reduce the amount of garbage you throw away. Instead of two full bags, start by throwing away one bag a week and reduce the amount as you go along. Also, instead of using paper bags, use lunch boxes when you take your lunch out to eat. And use plastic containers for sandwiches and any other food items. Use a thermos instead of a plastic cup for your drink or any other liquids or broths you bring. And reuse your plastic bags. Thank you, Dr. Richardson, for giving us an interview on how to improve the amount of garbage we create. No, thank you, Katie. Our next interview is with Joey Loward, a student at Jackson High School. Mr. Loward, how do you feel about all the garbage on our earth? It's terrible, man. I'm totally worse producing away. Too much garbage. Oh, and by the way, call me Mr. Joey. That would make me sound too much like a coward. And Mr. makes me sound all grown up. But my mom says and I will be. Okay, Mr. Joey. So tell me how you feel about this. Did you know one-fourth of our landfills are paper and one-third of our landfills are food? That's amazing, man. Oh, and speaking of food, what are you having? I'm having meatloaf. Okay, so you're saying? What are your feelings for all the landfill sites we are using? Yeah, gross, man. There's are those pesky little blobs of seaweed on your longboard, dude. Oh, and by the way, what are you with your meatloaf? Stay on topic. Sorry, I promise trying to stay on topic. Wait, wait, wait. What drink are you having with your meatloaf? <sighs> Back to you, Nina. Thank you, Katie. Once again, thank you, Dr. Richardson and Mr. Joey Lauer for those great interviews. Remember to be careful about what you throw away, because someday what you live in could be what you've thrown out. I'm Nina Packard here in Environment News. Thank you.